Man who nearly died in a car accident back in May is now back on his feet. And today he met the first responders who saved his life. It was a heartwarming moment and Fox 59's Brett Cast was right there. A terrible accident is what led first responders to the corner of South Emerson and English the morning of May 25th. There they found this Dodge pickup truck and a young man trapped. It was a much more serious accident than we were anticipating. When they saw the truck, first responders instantly knew the passenger inside must be critically hurt. And when Angela Dameron saw the truck, she knew the passenger was her son. I was panicked. I thought he was gone myself. She easily identified the distinct blue truck as her son's and rushed to the hospital, identifying him by his tattoos. It's been rough ever since, but the recovery is, I can't believe the recovery. Her son Devin stayed just one night in the hospital. He's had physical therapy to overcome a severe head injury. Now he's here today, meeting the first responders who saved him for the first time. I was just in shock. I'm like, I'm actually still here from that, and it's because of them. So three days before his 22nd birthday, Devin is here to thank his heroes, who say another hero, his seatbelt, deserves credit too. I believe if he wasn't restrained, he probably would have gone all the way through the windshield, which would have been a much more serious accident. A miraculous recovery, a touching moment, one that neither patient nor paramedic is taking for granted. Almost 13 years of doing this, maybe a handful of times, I've met someone that we've had on a run as a patient. It doesn't happen very often, for sure. On the east side, Brett Cast, Fox 59 News. And happy wow. birthday. Two other passengers were injured in that accident, but they have also recovered. Damron will be celebrating his 22nd birthday on Saturday.